called Alla Scoberta dell'America, Discovering America. The project, now arrived at its second edition, has had great success and involves encounters about the history, literature, international relationships and geopolitics of America. The aim is to provide students with information, knowledge, expertise and competence to help understand and acknowledge the complexity of worldwide phenomena and overcome certain stereotypes that sometimes pass for generations. I'm very happy and proud to be standing here representing these students and bringing their regards to you. Italian high school students are 13 to 14 years old when they decide whether their studies will be more science-oriented or will focus more on literature, on art, psychology or languages. This happens in traditional lyceums, or they can always choose a professional school with more technical skills. Before they leave high school at 18 or 19 years old, they have to pass an exam, which they prepare for in the last three years of their journey, especially the last one. In those three final years, they each complete a total of hours, a minimum of 90 hours especially, of acti activities which aim to make them experience the reality of the working world. By engaging in activities that both include school subjects, but also prepare students for a future path to later on pursue, projects like Al Scoberta of America represent a great opportunity to have more direct approach with different realities that might benefit and also influence our career orientation. One of the peculiarities of the Italian method is its focus and its pride surrounding the humanistic subjects. Those make up a significant part of our culture and preaching the importance of safeguarding our cultural heritage of our beautiful country. We sincerely invite you to visit Italy, since, as my father already said in this conference, America needs Italy, but Italy also really needs America, and its future needs you. Thank you for your precious contribution, and we expect teenagers, in presence or through Zoom, to discuss directly with Italian students about differences in the school systems, how Italian students are perceived in America, and vice versa, and how to contrast from both parts the fake news that social media depict about a representation of USA and Italy. Thank you. Umberto, you're gonna have to forgive me. I was uh, working on a thing here. Do you have any, anybody have more questions before you sit down? Wait, everybody got their time to work? Good? Any questions? No? Thank you, Umberto, you're the best. <laughs> All right, so we have 10 minutes till three o'clock. Let's come back at three o'clock and uh, we'll talk about 